In a distant land, long ago, there lived a young boy named Daniel. Daniel was a special boy, chosen by God for a remarkable purpose. He lived in a small village nestled in a valley, surrounded by rolling hills and fields of golden wheat. Daniel's family was known for their strong faith in God, and they taught him to trust and love the Almighty from a very young age. Every day, Daniel would wake up with the sunrise, and before he did anything else, he would kneel and offer a prayer of thanks to God. His parents had instilled in him the importance of faith, and he carried this lesson with him throughout his life. As Daniel grew older, his faith in God only deepened. He was a kind and gentle boy who always helped his family and neighbors. He had a special way with animals, and he often spent his days tending to the sheep in the lush green pastures surrounding his village. The sheep loved him, and they followed him wherever he went, as if they knew he was a guardian sent by God. One sunny morning as Daniel was out in the fields with the sheep, something extraordinary happened. He noticed a radiant light shining down from the heavens. It was so brilliant that it nearly blinded him. He shielded his eyes from the glare and gazed upward, wondering what could be the cause of this celestial spectacle. As he watched, the light became even brighter, and suddenly, a magnificent angel appeared before him. The angel's presence was overwhelming, and Daniel fell to his knees in awe. Daniel, the angel said in a voice that was both gentle and powerful, do not be afraid, for God has sent me to deliver a message to you. Daniel, trembling with both fear and excitement, managed to reply, I am here, and I am listening. The angel smiled warmly and continued, God is pleased with your unwavering faith and your love for him. He has chosen you for a special purpose, Daniel. You will be taken to a distant land, a place called Babylon, where you will serve in the court of the king. Daniel was astonished by the angel's words. He had never imagined that he, a simple shepherd boy from a small village, would be chosen for such a remarkable destiny. But he trusted in God's plan and knew that he must obey. Years passed, and Daniel, along with his friends Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, was indeed taken to Babylon. They faced many challenges and temptations in this foreign land, but their faith remained unshaken. In Babylon, King Nebuchadnezzar ruled with an iron fist. He was a powerful and proud king who believed that he was the greatest ruler in the world. One day, he decided to test the loyalty of his subjects in a way that would forever change Daniel's life. King Nebuchadnezzar ordered a magnificent golden statue to be built in his honor. It was an enormous statue, 90 feet tall and 9 feet wide. The king decreed that, at the sound of music, everyone in the kingdom must bow down and worship the golden image. Those who refused would face a terrible punishment. They would be thrown into a fiery furnace. News of the king's decree spread throughout the land like wildfire. When the appointed day arrived, the sound of trumpets and lyres filled the air as the people gathered before the golden statue. The crowd was vast, and among them were Daniel and his friends, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego. However, when the music played, Daniel and his friends remained standing, refusing to bow down to the idol. Their hearts were filled with unwavering faith in the one true God, and they knew that they could not worship false gods. Break time equal sign, 500 M's. Break time equal sign, 500 M's, slash break. 